All right, guys, just a quick update. I, uh, as you can see, stripped the whole side of this side of the bike. Uh, figured while everything was off, you could take a look at all the stock stuff, fuel filter. Uh, I was hanging down like this, so I kind of used the other hose to tack it in there for now, so it wasn't hanging in the way. Um, got the exhaust off, because the uh, exhaust I ordered will be here Tuesday. So we got that off from there. Um, it'll be interesting to see if the Grom exhaust works for this, for the simple fact of that way that hole is. Uh, sorry, the way that hole is right there. Um, as you can see, the cylinder, it's like missing a piece right there. So be curious to see how that'll butt up um, to it. And uh, if it'll fit right in or give us an issue with a leak where I might need to get a spacer or whatnot. Uh, another thing I noticed, these bikes, obviously, the price you get, cheap hardware. I'm having trouble getting the set off. That's stripped out. And that was just one, like, slight turn of a hand screwdriver. And it stripped instantly. So we'll be ordering all Grand Honda quality uh, hardware to put these plastics back on. But I figured while well, I have everything off, take the exhaust off. Uh, the reason I was taking it off was to do the fender eliminator. As you can see, we've got that giant uh, rear section out. This thing is heavy as hell. Um, so right there, some weight savings, that luggage rack, uh, the old exhaust is right there. Um, that thing was heavy as hell too. Um, well, so the whole thing was because the exhaust is coming Tuesday and I figured while I had everything out, I'll take that all apart to do the Makuni carb. Um, but as I'm going through, I'm finding some loose wires. Um, some things were unplugged, some things that could be adjusted as far as lines being ran. So all things to be expected, you know, when I researched this bike, watched everybody's video like Maxi Pad Moto, Bang Bang Scooter Gang, they all advised this. They all advised to, you know, check everything over, give it a once over and whatnot. So. That's what we're doing right now. We're just going through the bike and uh, just making sure everything's uh, tightened down, has a Loctite on it. You know, like I said, we want it to perform to the standards of an actual Honda Grom. So we want to make sure that this thing is spot on and ready to run for the spring. So stay tuned.